Have you ever wondered how gender and caste influence India's labor market? Well, the concept of intersectionality provides a lens to understand this. It suggests that our identities, like gender and caste, don't exist in isolation but intersect, influencing our experiences. In India's labor market, these two social stratifiers intersect in profound ways, shaping the unique experiences of individuals, particularly women from lower castes. Let's delve deeper into this complex dynamic through a case study. Meet Sunita, a lower caste woman from rural India. Born into a world where her gender and caste were predetermined, Sunita's journey into the labor market has been anything but smooth. She, like many other lower caste women, faces a double-edged sword of discrimination, one side being her gender, the other, her caste. Sunita's tale is not unique. It reflects a broader systemic issue that plagues India's labor market. You see, the intersection of gender and caste drastically affects women's participation in the workforce, especially those from lower castes. The National Sample Survey Office reports that less than a quarter of lower caste women in rural areas are employed in regular salaried jobs. This is not just about numbers, it's about lives. Lives like Sunita's, who despite having the same dreams and aspirations as any of us, are caught in a web of systemic bias and discrimination. Studies from the World Bank reveal that women from lower castes are often relegated to low-paying, insecure jobs and are more likely to experience wage discrimination and job segregation. This, my friends, is the reality of lower caste women in India's labor market. A reality where their potential is stifled, their dreams are crushed, and their voices are silenced. Sunita's story is not an isolated one. It's a testament to the struggles faced by countless others like her. It's time to challenge these deep-seated biases and disparities. We can no longer turn a blind eye to the intersectionality of gender and caste discrimination that plagues our labor market. It's not just a matter of justice, but of economic practicality as well. Imagine a labor market where every individual, regardless of their gender or caste, can contribute their skills and talents. A market that is not only diverse, but also inclusive. This is not just a dream, it's a potential reality that can lead to significant economic growth and social equality. But to achieve this, we need sweeping policy changes that address these systemic issues. We need to foster social awareness that challenges stereotypes and breaks down barriers. We need to ensure equal opportunities and fair treatment for all, especially for women from lower castes who have been doubly marginalized. Change begins with you. Stand against gender and caste discrimination. Advocate for a more equitable labor market. Together we can make a difference.